I think Tommy is not only a great golfer, I think he's going to be a great host. I've seen the guy's personality and he puts everybody at ease. I think yeah. you will be a good host. I think you'll be a better host than a golfer. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very, very proud to be doing it. It's uh, from a northern man with a northern company and we're bringing it to Southport with a northern boy hosting it. What more can I ask for? And tell me, Tommy, tell me something about your academy that you're putting together. Yeah, yeah. I mean, first of all, like, you know, thank you for being part of this event. And it's been my my key message the whole time has been to make it very northern. So, you know, us partnering together, it's just the absolute perfect match. Um, but for, you know, for a while I've been thinking about, I'm, I'm massively into... It's the game that it's the game that I love. Golf is the game that I've grown up playing, um, and I'm hugely interested in growing it. I, I, I spend all my time with people that love the game, so kids in kids in particular being able to have that you know access to the sport is massive to me. So um, me and my wife have decided to start the Tommy Fleetwood Academy, um, which is in Southport at Formby All Golf Club. That's where it's going to be. And um, it's it's a big it's a bit it's a big thing for us. It's a big move for us just starting that, and it's our first step really into into making things happen that I want to happen and um, giving kids the chance to you know le learn the game, spend time with people, make friends, and and you know just just have a bit of fun and enjoyment whilst getting better at the game. It sounds fantastic. Um, I'm doing something a bit similar myself, but I'll talk to you after the show about yeah. that. But, you know, giving kids a chance, it keeps them off the street. It, it, crime yeah. rates go down. It's a wonderful thing that you're doing. Thank and you. can I just mention something that I'd like to do for you? For every birdie that you do, I'm going to give £1,000 to your academy. And for every eagle that you do, I'm going to give £2,000 <laughs> to your academy. So that might be That's, a, a one more ring up, rung up the ladder for it's you. It's unbelievably generous. No pressure on me performing well now, but thank you very much. Okay. That's, that's well, really, really kind. You, you're welcome. And it'll be a, going to a deserved course. Yeah, thank you very much. So that really is generous because, um, you know, as you know, like as, if there's a hole in one on the 16th this week, um, we've, got, we've got two charities that are part of the tournament, the Marina Dalglish Foundation, and Claire's House, two unbelievably great um, local charities, and for that, hole in one on the sixteenth, and you give and you're giving twenty five thousand pounds to each. So um, we're honestly so so grateful for all these opportunities and everything you're doing for us. I hope you get that hole in one. I <laughs> me me does too. It for you. Thank you very much. I'm just much. thinking, why don't you two fellas to work together and get the Ryder Cup in the Northwest? That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Dream big. Uh, yeah, dream that's, big. That's exactly. What, that's what it's dream all about. And, yeah. uh, how good, was that? Deserves it. How good was that last year, the Ryder Cup? Oh, the, the Ryder Cup's the best. It's the biggest. We all, you know, when it's on, it's the biggest sporting event in the world. For us to have the chance to be part of it, it's amazing. Um, but you, you never know. A North West Ryder Cup. And how would you bet it? Getting it here. <laughs> <I've got one. laughs> because if I can help, ask me. That I've got one more question for you. You're an Everton fan. You're a Manchester United fan. Surely Liverpool can't win the title. No, they can't win it's, it. it I, there's, been, there's been some panic this year, to be honest. Um, but I, I'm feeling a little bit more at ease now, but it's still not quite there. But no, surely Liverpool cannot, cannot win the title. We're all relying on City. Well, let me tell you, for the last 25 years, I've been pushing the price of Liverpool out every year and they paid for my holidays, and very nice holidays in nice suites, private jets, etc. <laughs> I've got to thank the Scousers. They've got a chance of getting it all back off me this year, <laughs> but I'm still shouting <laughs> at City least, Exactly, at least there's some good coming from it. <laughs> Come on, City. Oh.